adult. So, I'm actually doing a video. Be surprised about that. I most certainly am. But today I'm gonna be doing my everyday makeup routine um, for what I've been doing, like not every day, like I don't wear makeup every day, but when I have the time and the energy to do makeup, um, I'm gonna be showing you what I've been using, what products I've been loving, um, especially for kind of more dry, summer, kind of ash air, <laughs> uh, polluted there. Um, yeah, so I'll be showing you all my favorite products. So let's get on with the video. So the first product is the Professional Primer. This is the new hydrating primer. And I got this from Sephora, so it's only a little mini. And I've actually been more into primer recently just because I think it does something. I don't know. I used to just think primer doesn't do shit. Um, but I think it does something. And I actually quite like the um, that primer because it's like a hydrating one. Because um, sometimes the other one is the pore filling one. It's just too much. Um, so now I'm just taking my Clean Matte BB from CoverGirl. This is like my favourite product. I've been using this for years. It's just you can't really get it in the UK because we don't have CoverGirl. So it's BB cream for oily skin and I have it in the shade Fair 510. I'm using my Beauty Blender which is legit falling apart. Um, freshly wetted. <laughs> Good English skills right there. Um, I like this. I think I've, I've used this before on my channel, but it's a good color match and it's like not as heavy as another foundation, like a typical foundation. And it is for more oily skin and I, I do have oily combination skin. And it still has like good coverage and everything, like it hides my redness and things like that. So you still get a glow from the primer, which is really nice. Um, and then for um, my concealer, I use the I use the Maybelline Fit Me concealer because it's really hydrating and it just blends really nice. Um, this is in the shade 15, so this is the lightest color. And I have the shade 20 as well, which I use for more like spot concealing because this is lighter. Um, and I just put that, you know, in the usual areas. So, what's everybody been up to in England? I know there's been a lot of storms. Like Storm Derek. I want to know who picks these storm names, because Storm Derek, like, is hilarious. Like, I'm sure he's not hilarious when your house is being flooded, um, but, like, the name... Okay, so I'm going to talk about some favourites, <laughs> 2019 favourites and 2020 favourites so far. So my favourite film has been Parasite, it was amazing, like when I watched like, uh, we did like an Oscar screening at my uni, everyone cheered so loud when they won and Bong Joon-ho won. And I love him. I watched Snowpiercer yesterday. It's really good. It's like kind of weird. It's got um, the guy who plays the dad, Mr. Kim. Um, from Parasite, yeah. And then I'm just gonna take my Maybelline Fit Me in the shade 10. And I'm just gonna put that just to set my face. Um, favorite kind of mu favorite music. Um. I really love that Billie Eilish, the Billie Eilish, No Time To Die. Oh, I love a good James Bond theme song. theme song. It's just really like powerful and she's got amazing vocals. I just love her, she's great. And she's like 18 and she makes me want to reevaluate my life and what decisions I've made um, because she's so talented. So I'm going to talk about other things. So what else has been happening with me so I'm a year abroad, um, I've been to loads of places, so I obviously live in Los Angeles, um, but I've been to New Orleans, I've been to New York, I've been to uh, San Diego, which is really nice, um, I've been 
to loads of places in LA like Hollywood and we went on for a bit of a President's Day, I know, bloody bullshit. We went on a hike to Echo Mountain, which was hard but good, like you're like sweating so much to get to the top and you're so red and stuff, but then like you just feel so proud that you, you were able to do it. And then I'm just trying to like eat loads of food, like Chick-fil-A is amazing, although like the company is very not, but the food is really good. Um, I went on Celebrity Family Food, not me, I'm not a celebrity yet, but um, I went on Celebrity Family Food as a guest and I was right at the front, as a guest, as a viewer, and I saw RuPaul, RuPaul, Michelle, Carson, Raven, and Latrice, it was amazing, it was incredible. Okay, so now I've powdered my face, um, I then take any sort of setting spray, so I'm going to take my, my Catrice illuminating spray, which is running out, I need to get some more. And I just put that on just so my face doesn't look as dry. Um, another favorite of mine is, um, was Star Wars, The Rise of Skywalker. Two face bronzer. Um, maybe controversial to some, maybe not to others. Um, I, love Adam Driver <laughs> especially as Kylo Ren and um, I love him in this film I love Daisy Ridley in this film they are amazing together um, I, I just really I love the film for me like the Star Wars sequels are my films they're my favorite of all the star wars films because i never grew up on star wars i grew up on lord of the rings um so i didn't never had an emotional attachment like i had to i re-watched all of the star wars including the prequels before force awakens came out and like that was quite a long time ago but defo um just i don't know i just don't get the hype they just no um, okay, so I'm going to take a highlighter and I'm going to take, this is a MAC Christmas collection um, from like three years ago. Um, this is in the shade Tutu and it's really pretty, as you will see. Um, really gorgeous highlighter. It's pretty pale, so I have to... I know I'm pale but like I don't know I feel like I have like gotten a bit darker you would kind of think so mm. the blush which is in the shade at dusk and I'm gonna pack that on and I'm gonna put it where blush goes <laughs> I'm a potion or night is something else this is great because I have oily eyelids I've, I've used this probably in most of my makeup videos um, just every other eye primer just doesn't last I'm then gonna set that with my Jeffree Star thirsty palette um, it, there's a shade called parched oh look how gorgeous that palette oh that palette is this palette is beautiful and I'm gonna just set my eyelids. Taking the same palette, I'm always do for like, I always go for more kind of either pinks or browns. Um, so I'm gonna take the shade Stroke and I'm just gonna tap that on my eye. Okay, and then I'm gonna take the shade Drizzle and I'm just gonna put that on top of that color. I feel like for every day, I always just like, keep it matte um, and kind of keep it more brown. It depends, it depends on what I'm wearing. If I'm wearing like a pink top, then I'm gonna wear more pink. But if I'm wearing a blue top, I'm not gonna wear bright blue, you know? <laughs> 
if that's your vibe, then that is your vibe, I can only be. And then I'm gonna put those colors under my eye. Just, I always pinch it like that. And um, what I've been doing is I take the Brow Wiz in the shade Ash Brown, and then I take a eyebrow gel, which is darker in the shade Dark Brown from Anastasia. And I do that because then it matches my hair colour. Then I'm going to go in with my MAC Shimmering Thing. This is in the shade Oh Darling. It's like a highlighter. It's so pretty. Um, I'm going to try and find a brush. I'm going to take it in my inner corner because it's nice and gold. Yeah, it's so golden. Boom. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, Harry Styles as well as be their favorite. The album. Not all the songs, but Golden, Adore You, Watermelon Sugar, Lights Up. So I'm now going to set my face. I'm going to take the Mary Badescu water in the rose one. I'm going to take my Fenty Gloss. This is in the shade Fenty Glow. I actually have the new, well, it's not new, but I bought one in the shade Fussy or two dollar signs. That's more pink, so if I do my pinks, the pink looks go with the pinks, but this is nude. This is just a, an amazing gloss. Everyone should buy the Fenty glosses. Okay, and then the final step is mascara. So I'm going to take my classic last sensational lash. <coughs> Sorry. I'm recovering from an illness. Lash Sensational Mascara. Um, and this is just the best. I got a new one. So it's lovely and fresh. In the shade Black is Black. So that is the finished makeup. So this is my everyday, like not everyday, but like if I am to do makeup for daytime, this is what I usually go for. I really like it because it's glowy, it's got highlighter, it's more simple in the eye and really glossy on the lip and you just like I don't want to go super heavy so the BB cream is great I'm using a lot of my hands um so if you guys like this video and want to see more makeup videos or other things like that make sure to go make sure to give this video a like and subscribe comment down below if you have any other video ideas or anything you guys want me to do I will do a tour of my campus very soon um yeah guys i guys i i just can't speak today um i will also link in the description my instagram and my twitter they're great places and my other um video the last video i did which was a massive la thrift tour um if you guys want me to do any other thrift videos i will happily oblige i am love shopping um yeah so guys i hope you're having a great week and i will see you soon bye